Welcome to the Totally Awesome Outdoor Show. In this little episode, I'm going to show you one of the easiest things to make. It is going to be made out of one piece of pallet wood, just a piece, but it's quite a thick one. It's about, let's have a little looky here, not quite an inch, I'd say three quarters of an inch thick. It is four inches wide. Now, I think you need four inches wide to make this, and it's about 35 inches long, that's how I cut it. You can make a Let's call it a mobile boot remover, so you can take your Wellington boots off, anything like that when you have trouble, not necessarily at the house, I've already made one for the house and attached it to a big uh, engineering block, you might have a look at the show more, there'll be a link in there somewhere that Mike's put in there if you want to make one for the house, this one is just for putting in the back of your car, so when you want to take your boots off, put your shoes on and get in the car, you don't have to get in the front of the car with huge great big muddy uh, Wellington boots. Okay, so what I'm going to do, dead easy to do really. Right, you get your piece of wood. It tastes a bit peculiar. Ooh. Hillary, what did you put in this tea? What do you mean it's not tea? It's disgusting. Have you put sugar in it? You do what? With the orange cap? It says Miracle Stain Remover. Oh, that's disgusting. Well, I've got to keep on with this job. Thanks for that, appreciate it. Stain remover. Can't be good for you, can it? Anyway, let's crack on. Right, I've got my piece of wood and uh, it's gonna... I've got my piece of wood and it's gonna be cut down to... There's something wrong with my voice. Right, let's get, let's get started. Who is that? Have a First thing I do is measure this here, get the pencil, make sure the V is clear there. That's all it needs is a very small bit to raise it above the floor. That's a piece I want, that's a piece I don't. Let's whiz that off. I'm just going to nail this underneath the V. I don't want it there, I want it just clear of the V itself. I'm going to be using a couple of galvanised two inch nails. I put one this side and one slightly down at an angle. That will stop it twisting. I'm not going to go through and nail it to my concrete floor. <laughs> I'm going to put a piece of wood under there and then Finish it off like that, turn it upside down, any tag ends, fold them over, measure one and a half boot lengths from here, so I've got one to tread on at the back, cut that off, take my set square, mark it across here, pick up the jigsaw, Cut off ready. That's the shape it's going to be, slightly raised, but I'm going to put a chamfer across here, altering the angle of the jigsaw, and cut that at an angle so it sits flat on the ground, keeps it all nice and stable. Okay, what I've done, I've moved the base plate 
at an angle there to give me the slanted cut with the jigsaw so it would actually be riding flat like this on the wood and yet the blade is off at an angle there. Always be careful all DIY, usual safety stuff, goggles, clean underpants, all that sort of stuff. It's all common sense to me, but there are people out there that don't appear to have any. Be careful with the power tools. And be careful with what you're drinking. Could end up with a very dodgy cup of tea. There you go, there's a slanted angle there. And you can see when I place it on the floor, it actually gives me a little bit more increase at the front. I put one boot at the back, just like this. Put the other one in the V, pull back, boots off. Change feet, boot that one out of the way, boot that one out of the way. <laughs> Should be on television. Same with that one, pull it out, dead easy. Boot out of the way, put your shoes on, get in the car. Easy to make, literally 10 minutes work. You can stain it, paint it. Personally, I'm just gonna leave it as that light would like that. And that's how it works. Easy peasy. What am I gonna do about this voice? It just sounds so peculiar. It reminds me of somebody. I can't think who it reminds me of. It reminds me of me. That's right, Mickey Mouse. Yeah. Or something? No, I'm not your brother. Oh. Come here. Got a job for you.